What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video, the final video in the team by team four round mock drafts. It's been a long and wild ride, but here we go. The San Francisco 49ers who, who uh, we're going to be waiting around for a little bit here to make a selection because they do not pick until the 90s. That is right. Uh, just with the trades that they've made recently, obviously the haul that they gave up for Trey Lance, the Christian McCaffrey trade. Uh, yeah, they are left with, let's see here before I share my screen and I want to have the right information here. They don't pick until 99. So they got 99, 101, 102. And that is it in terms of what we'll be picking within this. They do have some day three draft capital. So, you know, rounds five, six, and seven, they got quite a few picks as well. Maybe they'll be active and looking to move up or something. I'm not sure. Um, but that's a pretty good roster too. Obviously, you know, we don't know the state of the quarterback there, but, I look maybe offensive tackle. They lost Mike McGlinchey. Don't know there's going to be one in that spot. Corner, uh, maybe guard or center as well. Safety, I think that could be in play if I'm thinking about what the 49ers need. But we will. Uh, I'll share my screen, and we'll work through this and see how we can help the Niners. Young, Stroud, Anderson, Richardson. Stroud at two almost is starting to feel like that's a hot take to say it's going to happen, like just with what we've heard lately. So. We'll see. It could just be, you know, draft week BS. Steelers still going wide receiver at 17 in these. Keep seeing it. Should have made the speed faster since we don't pick for all these, but it's interesting to watch. Mayer didn't go until 36. Hendon Hooker to the Packers. Okay. Love the Steve Avila fit for the Steelers. Brent's at 56. That's really good value. Mozzie didn't go till 61. Darnell Washington's still on the board here. Somebody's going to take him, right? Imagine he falls all the way to 99 and we just paired Darnell Washington and Kittle. Ah, uh, come on, Green Bay. Why are you robbing the league of this? You have a lot of fun with Sam Laporta, though, too. Two Iowa tight ends. I I can't do it. I would love to do it, but can't do it. All right. So we got three picks. All three of our picks are within this little spot here. So uh, got to have a pretty good idea of what we want to do with all three of them. So we will talk through What do they consider their needs here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I said them earlier. Offensive line, basically any spot, corner, and safety. All right. So I think what we want to get here. Start off with Christopher Smith, big fan. They go, they take the other safety, Brown. We're going to take a developmental offensive tackle in Bergeron, who could also play guard. And then finally, yeah, we'll go Caillou Blue Kelly, the corner out of Stanford, who is really good at the senior bowl. Great length. Part of this incredible corner class, the 49ers would love to get involved in, in my opinion. Might as well use one of those spots on them. I had had, you know what I could see happening too? Was he still on the board in that spot? He might not even have been on the board unless he won shortly after. Yeah, he wasn't there. When in the world did Izzy Abanacanda go? Wow, all the way up there at 69. I love that fit for Shanahan if he were to fall to that comp. One of those comp picks. All right. There it is. San Francisco 49ers, Christopher Smith, Matthew Burge, Ron, Caillou, Blue Kelly. Three picks within four picks, and that's all they get within those four rounds. So 
Might be wondering why did I do a four round mock draft for them just to stay consistent. Got a whole playlist of four round mock drafts for every team in the NFL. You can go back and check it out. But let me know how you feel about this haul for the Niners. I think given, you know, the capital that they had to work with having to wait around for those spots, you still get pretty good value there. And you're taking advantage of two really strong groups in this class. So let me know how you're feeling about it. And uh, whether you're a Niners fan or not, just let me know how you feel about the selections, what you would have done differently in the rare occasion you agree with me. But uh, again, I can't thank you guys enough for checking these out. That's it for the four round mock drafts. Had a lot of fun doing them, put a lot of time into them, a lot of time making the videos. So let me know how you feel. I appreciate everybody for checking out one of them, let alone if you did all 32. So thanks again. Be sure to subscribe, like the channel, hit that notification bell, all that good stuff. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.